On a cattle drive, you would have had approximately 2,000 head of cattle, 12 to 15 cowboys. And how do you feed them? Well, that's where the chuck wagon comes from. And the chuck wagon is a mobile kitchen. This is the chuck box. And what makes this unusual is when you open and put the lid down, now you have a work surface. And so, and you can fold this up and down when you're traveling. In this box, you would have carried all of your small items, utensils, whatever seasonings you had, et cetera, that would have been in this box. Then the wagon is where you would carry all of your big things. Now, of course, here are the things that the cook would have used. Here's a deal where you could shave or clean up. All your bed rolls, salt belly, any food items would have been in this wagon. They normally would have had another wagon with them called the hoodlum wagon that carried water and firewood. But you have your ropes and, and, and pulleys and all that to travel because they were traveling long distances. So what we have, we have a wagon and when you put a chuck box in the wagon, it becomes a chuck wagon. This is a traditional meal on a chuck wagon. You would have had pinto beans that could have traveled with lots of salt pork in them. Here's a little more salt pork that's just been boiled. This is the protein. And then of course, sourdough biscuits. And that was the favorite on all the wagons. And you cook this in a Dutch oven. But I'm gonna finish with one thing, the drink of choice, which was coffee. And this was probably Arbuckle's coffee. Now that's a cup of coffee. I started raising cattle in 65. When I started, I found myself migrating to what we call the chuck wagon because I've always enjoyed cooking. So after we made our first drive in the morning, I'd take off and go cook. The method of cooking that they used on the early trail drive is the same method we use here at Perennial Ranch Steakhouse. And good beef, in our case, we use a Perennial Ranch steak rub, and we have a mesquite fire that actually kisses the beef when it's cooking. And that is the old time way of cooking. So that's where the trail drives did it, and now we're doing it at the steakhouse.